Hey everybody, welcome to Thursday night. Scotch for dummies. Scotch Scotch for dummies. We are indeed it dummies. Has been, it feels like <laughs> yeah. it's been a long time since we've been in these seats. Yeah, I know. Uh, yeah. A lot of travel Traveling, going on. Yeah, and everybody's busy. It's summertime, so yeah, we all have family Gotta things work going time on. for Scotch, though. But mm, we yeah. are making time for Scotch Something tonight. Something special tonight. And yeah. a special one for us. Um, we picked this bottle up, God, it's been probably six weeks ago now, yeah. um, at that Vine and Table, our favorite liquor store. Mm. And uh, the only reason that we I picked like it up on that shopping, uh, shopping spree was because the uh, manager, Dennis, had sort of talked it up a little bit. We asked him a little bit of advice, and he pointed us towards the Ben Riech. Ben Riech. 17 Riech. Solstice. So uh, I think it was Hoagie over in Germany was really interested in seeing this. So. Um, Pay he attention. pointed it out in one of the videos. Like, yeah, he I saw the background. So, and the reason he pointed it out was because it offered something for all of us. Yes. Exactly. Yeah. So, gave a little bit of peat to Andrew, a little bit of sweet to the other people yes. in the group. Right. Yes. There may be some marzipan flavors in there. We're not maybe. sure yet. We'll maybe. find out, right? <laughs> we know that is right. now. <laughs> so Dennis had uh, yeah, find it. Check out my interview on Facebook. <laughs> <laughs> the manager said this would be the peacemaker amongst the four of us. So we shall see if this is the Because usually all we do is our you and yell at each other. Obviously, <laughs> we have drunk a little bit already, but um, anyway, we're gonna we're gonna give this a fair shake. A little bit about the distillery. Uh, opened in 1897, was closed three years later in Mothball for 65 years. Uh, picked back up and opened by Glenn Levitt in 65. Uh, at that point in time, I think they doubled the, the number of stills. Uh, Oh. And then most of the, the the liquor that they were producing was going into a Chivas Queen and Special Blend. Mm. Okay, I haven't had it, so I don't know much about it. But probably um, can't afford it. Yeah, probably couldn't afford it anyway. Um, <laughs> Sounds like uh, yeah. In 2004, it was bought by a private consortium, and uh, that's where it is right now. So oh. supposedly they produce peated wine finished or peated rum finished scotches. So this is a Ben Riek 17 Solstice Solstice. It smells delicious. It's from here. So it's heavily peated, but port and port finished. Right. So Isn't this the one that, that has all the weird agings? That like 17, 19. No, that was the the. Uh, <clears throat> Craig Alecky? Uh, we <laughs> that right? name. We can't even go down that road really anymore. Uh, we got a lot of comments on how bad we pronounced it. Nobody said we were perfect. Right. <laughs> so exactly. what is the color? Because you know the color is important. I smell it without even putting <laughs> it up oh to my mouth. I mean seriously. It's potent. So um, there's a, I get a little bit of smoke on the nose, but there, I, there's I so really much more to much. that. There's a little bit. Uh, yeah, so it's a little smoke, but I'm getting like vanilla and I think some of that port, uh, like a tawny port. I got no. your I got your barbecue chicken a little bit actually. Yeah. Barbecue chicken. Yeah, yeah I guess that barbecue chicken. Like, like a, like a, yeah. It's uh, that sweet savory. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> I get you. I'm getting your lips. I'm getting the olives. olives. Like uh like I, I get that tone. briny yeah. tone yeah. to it. Yeah. yeah. So this is vanilla. Uh, yeah. So this distillery is right on the north coast of Scotland. Just almost I mean it's technically a space island. Almost almost so hence the briny maybe it's quality. Cherry. Yeah, I was cherry? just I was gonna say I smell yeah, something red in there. Like so it's a red whole cherry like a it's in there. Yeah. This has nothing but good stuff going on in this glass. The nose I've really is it. is mm. interesting. There's a lot going on in the smell. It's got a nice bouquet. Um mm. Ooh, that is a, it does offer a lot. That is a fruity sweet. But it's got the smoke to it. It like builds towards it. Oh wow! The, the, it's, the, the first fit, first taste is real sweet and cherries it's, and it's almost like a chili pepper. You know what I mean? You don't get that that heat oh, coming yeah. on and then it builds later on and you're like, oh yeah, that, wasabi that is, almost or something. I mean, the smoke kind of What's builds that way. Damn it, man, that's good. It smells like molasses. Uh, that's a well balanced alcohol. Fifty percent. Ooh, so it's a little warm. It does, doesn't taste, taste warm. We we should probably have a couple glasses just to make sure. Just yeah. to make sure. <laughs> yeah, see, now I'm getting raisins on the nose. I'm getting good raisin smell. Yeah. It always changes after you taste that. So you've always got to you really taste does. it and then go back and smell it again. It really does. And I got toffee now too. Yes. Amen. Almost I like smell a that sweet brittle toffee. or something. Mm -hmm. Some peanut brittle. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and now I'm getting a little that's more of the delicious. smoke coming out. Can you dig it? <laughs> See, I'm, not, I'm getting toffee now. I'm getting the mm -hmm. the sweetness from that that port cask is really coming through. Wow, it's so interesting. It's, it's, it's got a lot. It, of it first hits your lips. It's so good, and it's um <laughs> so sweet. <laughs> it's so sweet. A little extra. Uh -huh. Little plug. A little sweet, and then uh, the smoke just hits you <laughs> and rolls to the back. Um, we're, this I, is get, I get a <laughs> sweet butter now. Um, 
I can it's some intense. Of that so it is kind of that wasabi, like pound your face type. Yeah, just hit but you. It, it, it like grows. Uh -huh. You know, uh, it's, it's, a nice but it's, it's it's not it's overwhelming. It's a good thing. It's no, not like not it hurts all. you. Or I'm not getting a lot of smoke now. Now I think I think if I let it sit and let the finish linger, I, the smoke would probably can ma maintain longer. No, I don't want to put any water on. So, um, I do. I don't. No, I don't remember what we paid for this. The receipts is somewhere in the box. We need to, to put a box. I don't think it's cheap. I think it was eighty nine. Probably. This, this is not a cheap. Right. I think it was eighty nine dollars uh, for that bottle. Um, Andrew, oh. I started talking. You did the pouring. Drew, you're up. Oh. Oh yeah. Right. Well, just a, a second. Here. <laughs> right. You're rushing. I'll, I'll put a splash in. Yeah, this definitely. Uh, it's the, not, the nose it's definitely not that. Why? Well, I mean, maybe it is kind of oily. Well, you just watered it too, so. Yeah. Yeah. Let me kind see what that is. So the it's nose still, is still holding up. It's still holding up. Look nose. at that light oh, coming man. down there, man. That's actually I enjoy the nose mount. It's it's got a little bit more fruitiness into it. Yeah, yeah it I does. enjoyed the freaking nose before this. I hope I don't mess this up. And it's still got the smoke, this the peat. This can it's still there. The water. Absolutely. <clears throat> yep. Mmm. It didn't diminish it okay. at all. No, it's it's a it's lot sweeter now with water. It, it brought out some of the vanilla notes. Mm-hmm. Ooh, I think I like it with water. water. That's a very good glass. Who's going first? It can hold its own. True, hit it. You ready? Do it, do it. I'll go. Do it. I'll go. Sean, go. I, I'm on this. Uh, this is a three. <laughs> Straight <laughs> up. Uh, it, it may be a three and a half, but I, I want to save some room for some of the other uh, bottles that are higher 17? up on this one. Seventeen. Uh, it's, you know, we're saying what, about 90 bucks for the bottle? Se yeah. Um, cheap. This has a lot of good stuff going on in it. It's, it's got it's got some smoke. It's got some we sweet. Like complexity. Uh, it holds up to water. It's not overpowering like some of the smoked peated scotches. I mean, it's got it there, but it's not overbearing by any stretch. It it blends very nicely with the port, and port to me has a lot going on. Oh, right. Line, yeah. So I mean, this this exemplifies a port finish to me. I mean, th there's so much fruit and different flavors. I mean, everybody here is talking about different things yeah. that they're pulling out. That's kind of cool. To me, that's what I'm looking for. That's exactly right. It's complex. It's got we something here to talk offer about for everyone. For it's hour. amazing glass. Uh, this is a solid three. I'm very happy with this. All right. Ah, that's a good one. That's a good review. I'm going to be called Scotch because I'm going to do a three five. I, this is delicious. I have 17 year, 90 bucks. I think it's a pretty good value. Mm. I never would have bought it, never heard of it. Uh, Dennis, thank you. I love this. Now we can't get enough of it. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, honestly, um, I really think this is a good good dram for someone who enjoys a sweet scotch and wants to try to meddle into that, that, that island. Give me some of that peat and that smoke. You know what? This is a great blend of it. This is going to ease them in. It's not going to punch them in the face. For 50 ABV, you can drink this neat, comfortably. Yeah, absolutely. Burn. I mean, not at all. Uh, but water does it justice to. I mean, it's uh, it's a delicious dram. I, I, yeah. The aroma, the the nose was great, neat. The nose was great with water, and so was the palate. So a three five from Scotch Horror. I'm in. <laughs> All right. I'm getting you a jersey with that on the back. That's it, baby. I'm, in. Yes. I'm <laughs> gonna give this a three finger out of four. This is this is a good scotch. Um, so when I when I when I approach this after we've had a little discussion, a little water on it, it it's very sweet, toffee kind of um, raisin smell. Uh, when I first take the palate on, I get that um, fruit cake a little bit. But but the interesting thing is when you blend it with the smoke. It almost tastes like um, a Kalamata olive. You know, you get that mm -hmm. kind of a that a, a little bit sweet. Yeah, you get man, a little bit of brine. Great, you get that. Great call. It's really a nice uh, a nice blend. It's not it's not as smoky as I've or not as peated as I expected, but it's still it's great. Good you know, balance. three yeah. three is a good solid yeah. three. Yes. Yeah. Good wow. Scotch. Good reviews, guys. I'll tell good you this. Do. This is delicious. <laughs> Good. There you go. He's done. I'm gonna, he's gonna give it a two or one and a half. I'm sure. I'm gonna give it a point five. This is actually a three five, hands down. No Boom! I, I actually yeah, yeah. for about five seconds. I thought about even a four because I really enjoy this. For ninety one. bucks, considering the price, some of the really expensive scotches, this is right up there. Yeah. And, the most and you guys know me. I'm a space cider. I like sweet and stuff, and this has some sure, of that. But sure. I also like the smoke and peat a little bit more now. And this is a nice blend. The price value is great. I think what you're getting for 17 years, the complexities there that I'm really looking for these days. Yep. Um, and it can hold water. 
Without a doubt, it can hold water. Yeah, it does. If you don't that want was the it, most surprising yeah. part. It, it, the the nose <laughs> is usually the ABV, first thing to go. You kind of expect it. Yeah, yeah right. but there's a lot of 50 ABVs that you put a little Fall water on, and, right. and the done. flavor can't yeah. handle it. The alcohol can God, handle it. that raisin. flavor. <laughs> yeah, so this, this <laughs> can handle the water. If you want it sweeter, you know, put a little bit of water, I think, on yeah, there. But the nose is good. Um, hands down, 3.5, if you've got a chance to buy some of this. No, absolutely. I'm just, it blows me away. I never even would have bought this bottle. Honestly, wouldn't have considered it on my own. So Dennis, um, thanks a lot. Yeah, thanks Dennis. Really I'm good. very excited. And we're going to have to break into the other ones, I guess, huh? At some point in time, we're going to have to... That's going to be hard. Okay, so, if you really want to. It doesn't look like we're running out of scotches to try anything. I'm not getting soon. short. we got a lot of great suggestions, so we appreciate it. Great comments, all of guys. Appreciate great it. Comments. Keep it coming. Absolutely. Um, be sure to check out us, check us out on Facebook. That's we're really right. trying to push some things over on, uh, on that medium as well. So... Guys, you can learn about marzipan over there. Yeah, you can learn about marzipan. <laughs> so we've got a three. A three, 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 five. Three, three, five. So 3.25 average. Five. Very Not good. Bad. Cheers, guys. Thanks, Cheers. For, Thanks for watching. The Drake 17 of Solstice. Mm. Yep. Delicious. Very. Hey, Scotch lovers. Thanks for watching. Joining the conversation. More videos below. And hit subscribe before you go so you can get the new videos when they come out. Awesome. Cheers.